Hey everybody, how are you? I hope everybody's staying safe and sane and well and everything else. It's been a little crazy for the last, gosh, uh, six, seven weeks. So we've been uh, doing uh, unique and different things at home, right? Well, so one of the things that I noticed about uh, two weeks ago when our housekeepers were here was that when they leave, they always throw the rags into the washing machine and then they leave and we just get them out of the dryer and uh, fold them up and whatever. So what I noticed was that out of the dryer came some uh, like bounty paper towels that had been washed. And so I thought to myself, wow, I was really surprised that they were as sturdy and still in good condition after they'd gone through the washing machine and the dryer. So this week what I did was I started saving all of our relatively clean uh, paper towels. And uh, so what I one did thing. was over the last week or so, I've been saving all the paper towels. So here they all are. And so I just put them in a, in a different uh, part of our cabinets. And so this is all of our paper towels. And I'm going to take this bag and go down to the washing machine. And load these things up. Let's move this for right here. So I'm just throwing them in the washing machine. The bag's pretty empty. There we go. I guess I probably better fluff them a little bit, huh? Don't you think? They're dirty. It's kind of gross, frankly. But I'm gonna see what happens, cause kind of excited about the uh, opportunity here. So one of the things that Lynn had suggested was that I include some some rags in there. So I'm gonna just throw a couple of. Just rags in here to wash with. And then we're gonna just add a little detergent. Not a lot, right? And then we'll set this thing up. So I'm guessing that we should probably set this on something like delicate. Huh, delicate, maybe normal. Hmm. Well, we're doing an experiment, so I'm just gonna go with normal. And we're gonna set the temperature. We'll set the temperature to hot and Spin speed, we probably should go medium. Soil level, yeah, we'll say normal. And uh, here we go. See you in about 26 minutes. So we're making good progress. We're in the spin cycle. It's just gonna be a couple more minutes and we'll go out of the washing machine and into the dryer. Okay, so I heard the washing machine end. So let's come check it out. Yep. It's done. So let's check it out. Wow. All right. So, wow, I think it worked. Check it out. So they're all stuck to the drum. There's a sock <laughs> and some of the rags. All right, so I'm going to just unload them. Just like normal. Maybe I'll try to fluff them up a little. Oh, some of these got a little wrinkled up. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, because I'm the only one holding the camera, I'm gonna put the camera down and then I'm gonna straighten some of these out and I'll fluff them up and I'm gonna okay. put them in the dryer. So that took a little longer than I expected, but probably only about like three or four minutes. And so I went through, grabbed them all out and I put them all here in the dryer. As you can see, all I did was like unwrap them. I didn't get too like in depth on this thing, right? So they're kind of just so they weren't all jammed up in a little ball. So we're going to set this thing up. Okay. So we're going to dial in, I'm going to dial in normal cotton and then we'll 
do we'll do normal dry level and all the rest of the stuff will just keep normal it says it's going to be on there for 41 minutes but it's not so because it's it knows when stuff gets dried off so here we go and away we go we'll see you in 41 minutes all right so we're checking in seeing what's going on still says 33 minutes but man those are looking pretty dry so i'm gonna give it a couple more minutes and so last time i saw you it was about 33 minutes uh we're down to two minutes and it was not has not been 20 like whatever eight minutes since we did this so it's been calculating that these things are dry so i'm gonna stop it and going in oh 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 geez can't do that you gotta use these maybe okay Wow, look at this. Look at these. This is crazy. Okay, well, here we go. So I'm going to grab these, take them into the kitchen, and we're gonna fold them up and see how they look. Okay, so I got them all out here, and now we're gonna see how many we got. All right, so this is a little crazy. So here's the situation. So I went and I got them all. And Lynn's laughing at me, but here's all of the toilet paper, and paper towels. This is bounty paper towels, by the way. Only bounty could survive. So we're gonna try to make these right, and uh, I don't know, make some sort of reasonable pile. Look at that, we found the sock that was lost. That's crazy. Anyway, so here we go. We're gonna check this out and I'll get back to you. Okay, so we're making progress as you can see. <laughs> it's become a two-man job <laughs> because there's a lot of freaking paper towels here, but we're getting close. Oh shit, I didn't. Oh yeah, I was recording, okay. So we're getting close. We still gotta go through a lot of these. We're making a big pile. I'll get and back. I, I, I will tell you, this is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. All right, well, Lynn's not into the But science. also we're gonna do a post test. We're going to take these recycled ones and test them against the original bounties. They'll be like the cheap paper towels against the bounty paper towels. Like, and then if these don't do any better than the cheap paper towels with a little like blue fairy lady, then we're going to buy the blue fairy lady. Okay, so to tell the truth, this was a little harder than I thought. I actually broke a sweat doing this and Lynn actually wound up helping. So um, I think you're gonna be very surprised. So here's the situation. These are the full paper towels. So I don't even know how many we got yet. So that's a ton of paper towels. Um, just to give you a sense of how tall they are. That's how tall it is. I don't know exactly how tall it is yet. You know what, maybe I can measure it. Okay, here we go. We have, technically, 16 inches of recycled, cleaned, reusable paper towels. Paper towels. I don't know how many that is yet, but I'll, you'll know in a minute. These, however, are the paper towels that were just kind of like scraps. And I think that these were scraps when they went into the trash. I don't think they were, they were damaged when we washed them. Then there were two paper towels, these right here, that are a little funky. They're just a little gross. You probably can't see the, the one, so I'm not gonna use those. And here is what's interesting. So I also, used some of the towels that come out of the Clorox thing. And uh, these really didn't hold up very well, which is kind of interesting. So uh, those are not reusable, um, I don't think. Which is really surprising, actually. So then I found this, which I don't know what it is. I think it might be one of those smelly things that you put in the dryer, but I don't know. 
Okay, so then I put found these again. Which are, these were the these were the the the, wa the washcloths that I used just to create a little ballast or you know whatever in the washing machine. And then I found the sock. And everybody has this sock. Yeah, totally lost it. It's the one it's sock gone, gone, that always over, shows up at the end of the dryer. Over, over the edge. And I don't know where that one came from. All right, so that's what we got. That's our stack of paper towels. I'm gonna count them. The whole thing probably took about an hour and 10 minutes, give or take, more or less. But here's what's interesting. I'm gonna show you kind of the results. Let's take a look. Okay. So, at the peanut gallery over there, we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 110, and three. We have 113 reusable bounty paper towels. Okay, the quicker picker upper. <laughs> but what's interesting is that this roll right here, which you can't find at the damn grocery store, only has, how many? 83 ply, uh, towelettes. So this thing has only 83, and I was able to get that many. Okay, so there we go. I think that we've proven that uh, this is a worthwhile experiment. Uh, we came up with 113 reusable towels, which we wouldn't have otherwise used because we would have thrown them away. Um, and uh, knowing and understanding that there's so few towels at the grocery store, it might be something that you want to do. Now, the lesson to really take away from this is this. In the event of the next pandemic or whatever critical national event that we might have, just go out and get stocked up on more paper towels because this is not the experiment that you want to be doing on a regular basis. But if you have to, you'd be okay. Hope you had fun. See you later. Be safe. Bye. All right. So we have discovered one downfall to this experiment. You'd need to figure out where you're going to put all of these um, paper towels because I was trying to put them in this drawer and they don't fit. So I got to figure out <laughs> where they're going to go. I don't know. This is harder than I thought. So Lynn has decided we need to add one additional part to this experiment, and that is how good are these new paper towels? So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do a shot of Coca-Cola. There. Coca-Cola, who says Coca-Cola? I'm gonna do that one. Already working. That one. And that one. This is our new paper towel, or I should say reused paper towel. There we go. Okay, so let's come back to the original. This is that, uh, what's that crappy paper towel, honey? Um, yeah, we don't know which one this one is. Uh, that one sucked. Okay, there's this one, which is Bounty, and you can see that, actually, that's doing pretty good. I think I just used too much Coke. Then there's this one, Bounty, um, and, um, and that's not so good, but it's doing okay. And then here's ours, and um, it's, uh, well, it's probably not as good as the others. Um, so... <laughs> If I had to rate these 
from Binky your... Paper Towel, whichever one that was, which yeah, is an original that's one. That's a sucky one. Okay, that one actually did, was the worst. This one did pretty good. This bounty, this was bounty. This bounty did pretty good. And then our recycled ones, eh, didn't do so great. It obviously was a little <laughs> bit lacking. Yeah, it's, so, it's a, but it held up. There we go, it held up. Look, it, it held it, up, look at that. It's fairly absorbent. It, it absorbed um, it. And if you weren't trying to clean up um, a shot of Coca-Cola, uh, I think you'd be fine. So, there you go.